CEO. Commit, execute, and be obsessed. Everybody be great out there. Big salute to all of my veterans out there. Man, big shout out to all of my subscribers. Man, I appreciate each and every one of you. Right now, out here on the trail, man, I want somebody to wake up with me. Somebody hit me up. Say, hey, Manny, I want to come PT with you. You know? That's what I want. I want somebody to come out here and PT with me. Who up for it? <laughs> hey, so in this quick content, man, I want to talk about flatbeds versus step deck trailers. Awesome. Hey, so don't comment below. What I want you guys to do is send me a text message. So we living in 2021. I have evolved. So, checking comments, and a lot of comments just be repetitive, you know, too. So, you guys can actually hit me up directly on this cell phone that I'm recording this video on. So, instead of commenting, I want you guys to send me a text message at 317-953-8943. If you just want to say, hey, what's up, Manny? I appreciate you. I accept those text messages. If you guys out there are looking for any type of training and mentorship if you guys have any questions on any type of programs and trainers that i offer send me a text message on the screen 317-953-8943 and that will come directly to me hey so real quick man in this quick piece of content i just want to put out there to you guys i know a lot of you guys out there are inspired and motivated which i encourage you guys Follow your dreams. Whatever you think about in your mind, you got to execute on it. That's why I tell you guys, CEO, commit, execute, and be obsessed. It's because I believe it. And I believe you guys will understand it once you do those three things. Once you commit, once you execute, and once you be obsessed about it. So I know a lot of you want to start your trucking company. So what I'm telling you guys right now, go out. Go get you a semi truck, go get you a flatbed trailer or a step deck trailer, 48 or 53 foot. But I'm going to say go get the 53 foot, you know, step deck trailer. But in this content, I'm going to just share with you on why I would choose the step deck over just a regular flatbed trailer. You know, so of course there is a difference. You got the step deck, the step deck could haul taller freight and you got your regular flatbed trailer. So for me, I'm going to go with the step deck trailer just because you can haul taller freight. So one thing I learned about, you know, trucking, and especially when it comes to dispatching your own trucks, is that you guys don't want to be limited. You know, so that's why I always tell you guys out there, if you go start a box trucking company, if you go start a hot shot trucking company, you're going to be limited to what you can haul. But it does not mean that you're not going to make money. You just have to figure it out. It's not going to be a whole bunch of opportunity and options for you on the low board versus if you guys go out and start with a semi truck because there's an abundance of freight on the low board for semi trucks. So for myself, I don't wanna be limited. So even with a semi truck, you don't wanna be limited to what you can haul. So as having a step deck trailer, you pretty much can haul taller freight that an actual flatbed trailer can't haul. A flatbed trailer could haul a load up to about seven to eight feet tall. A step deck trailer could haul a load up to 10 feet and maybe a little bit more over 10 feet. So that's a big difference when we're talking about a two foot difference. So, so there's going to be plenty of loads on the load board specifically for a step deck. But remember that step deck can also haul the same freight as a flatbed trailer too. So. Basically, you're opening up your options when you have that step deck trailer versus having that flatbed trailer. You know, but both of them will make you amazing money. The good thing I like about step decks and flatbeds is that you can haul oversized loads. And oversized loads, you know, pays very well too out here. So if you guys have a trucking company right now, if you're running flatbeds, step decks, even hot shots, if you guys are not hauling oversized loads, I encourage you guys you know, start hauling oversized loads too out here. And I know some of you guys might not be confident to haul oversized loads, but you got to think about it like this. That oversized load is pretty much 
going to be hauled just like a regular load. You just have to make sure that you are staying in your lane. <laughs> That's pretty much it, you know? So you can haul uh, oversized loads. An oversized load is anything over eight feet, six inches wide. So if it's eight feet, seven inches wide, that is considered an oversized load. You guys will need hauling permits per state to haul through, uh, I mean, to haul that load. So basically I was just gonna get off on a rant <laughs> about uh, oversized loads. You know, I can make more videos covering oversized loads, which I do have multiple videos on my channel right now. Even I show you guys out there how to start an oversized and over with permitted agency on my channel too. Go search for that video. So man, I just want to put this quick content out there to you guys today. Like I say, if you guys want to contact me, don't comment below because that's too slow for me. I'm in 2021. I'm always trying to figure out how can I better improve my system and cut the middleman out in whatever I'm doing. So you can hit me up directly coming straight to my phone number, right? I mean, straight to my cell phone <laughs> that I'm recording this video on right now. Hit me up. 317-953-8943. If you guys have any questions, also you can reach out to me through my email broker at managetrans.com. Go get your 30-day free trial with DAT. Go sign up with Tash Trans and Financial Services if you guys are looking for a factor in service. CEO, commit, execute, and be obsessed. Everybody be great out there.